the leaves are falling, the trees are gorgeous out there in my part of the of the planet. And for many of us who are, are on this hemisphere, we're watching the beautiful leaves change with the bright reds and oranges and yellows. And it's uh it's pretty amazing. And um one of my favorite trees to watch change in Colorado are the aspens. And so when I get the the luxury of seeing some aspens around, I get very, very excited. All right. So we are in the thick of it. And Miss Joanne is like Gina being a trooper of super bright early in the morning without the brightness yet <laughs> joining us. And, and so welcome, welcome. Okay. <sighs> There's a lot happening. And I don't think anyone, anyone is going unscathed right now. Right. I, the energies are are intense and we're they're accelerating at the same time. And so the more we can be in our bodies, in our space, doing our work, that's the way through. And the more and more we fall into the intensities of what's going on around us, that's when we start to create more separation from our core, from who we are. And Ray Ellen and I just had this beautiful conversation right before our talk about that, right? And we're watching particular people in our lives spiral because they're just in it. They're just like, okay, here's all the intensity. Let's let's be in it. And they're and they're just in a space of not being able to go beyond it. And so our tools around going behind our eyes, into our hearts, feeling our heartbeat are essential at this time to really get ourselves through. The focus of, of today, and I wrote this down, is where are we still being influenced? Where are the gaps within us where these outside influences trickle in and and create that within ourselves, that imbalance, that out of alignment for ourselves. And for some of us, it may still be around money stories or money loops. And we need this to get this and do that. And and it, or it could be around relationships or it could be around work or it could be around something. But this is where we're headed. And as I was doing my beautiful walk, watching the fall trees and walking on the leaves on the ground, that it's just magical. Really what started to come forward were all of these elemental beings. So we have these elemental beings that are really showing up for us to take us and ground us back in Pachamama, to recenter us, to reconnect us. And then at the same time, we have these, so it's just pulling into the earth at the same time. There's the dragon energies that are activating around us and they feel more cosmic and they feel more going up versus going in. And it's all going in, but going into the earth or going into the cosmos. So there's this interesting pulling of energies that are happening and it's all about our rediscovery. It's all about our reconnection right now. So this is where we're headed. 